Hello, All Sports Market. I'm Zach Ward with lots of great news, so let's get right into it. As Chris Robley would say, the Daily Fantasy Sports Boys are sucking it. Um, their ad spending is down 90% from last year, and rumors have it that their revenues are down 70%. <laughs> also, um, the New York Times reported that they are so broke they can't even pay their record-breaking $12 million in fines by the state of New York for lying to everyone about their scam. So they're reeling. They've got, taken a lot of big body blows, and they're about to hit the mat and get knocked out. This is a perfect opportunity for us. As most of you may know, uh, I played Scott Farkas in The Christmas Story, and everybody loves the movie. Um, because of that, everybody's interested in it every single year. My, the amount of people Googling me goes up exponentially around Christmas between Thanksgiving all the way to Christmas itself. For example, IMDB, or Internet Movie Database, uh, lets you know how many people are doing searches on your name. So if you're Robert Downey Jr. and you have Iron Man come out, you're number one. If you're me normally, I'm between three and five thousand, and it goes all the way up to two million. But usually I'm between three and five thousand. Around Christmas time, so many people are looking at me up, tens of millions of people, that I get all the way down to under a hundred, which is where Jack Nicholson and huge stars live in that area. So the whole idea is to utilize that interest in Gut Farkas and a Christmas story. Uh, to transfer the conversation to all sports market. And we're already off and running. As many of you may have seen, Hillary Clinton uh, put Scott Farkas as the headline bully in a campaign ad. That already is starting to make ripples on the IMDb. Um, and as soon as we get past Halloween, you can bet that's the ad they're going to be running since as soon as we get past Halloween, everybody's thinking about Thanksgiving and Thanksgiving and Christmas, our Christmas story. So that's one that's fantastic. Uh, number one is Vanity Fair is doing a big article on a Christmas story. Um, they will only interview three people. I'm one of them. So that comes at the beginning of December. And that's another, it's going to be another piece of free press that we're getting that would otherwise cost tens of millions of freaking dollars to get it done. And it's landing with a lot of prestige. And I think that's the other high point about Vanity Fair. In other news, and this is a little on the hush-hush, but I think it's important that you know. I just met with TBS, Turner Broadcasting Station. Station? Okay. And as you know, they run the 24-hour marathon every single year. Huge numbers. Uh, what they're trying to do right now is combine the digital and the linear TV. And they call it linear. I don't know why. So they want those to have similar stories. And they've been talking to me about doing Farkas, Scott Farkas campaign in digital that will also transition to broadcast. I just finished working with them and did an animation for them, wrote and produced that. So these deals are going well between them and I. I just met with them yesterday, literally last night. I met with the head of the broadcast uh, broadcast department. This is also controlling the digital. And they want to do at least three. And these things are real money. And TBS is going to put real money behind advertising. They're actually talking about... Um, fingers crossed, doing a Snapchat, promoting a Snapchat for the marathon so that uh, people can take a picture and then they have Scott Farkas's hat and the yellow eyes and the green teeth. My point is, all of this with Scott Farkas makes people Google it and go like, ah, that guy seems familiar, he had this movie come out, this other thing. And when they do that, we have to have product for them to take in about all sports market. This is key. We can't just let this go by us. We have to grab hold of it and you did use it to our advantage, like me learning how to speak. Okay, so look, it's really important that we get this awesome viral video made in time to grab all this attention. If we let this go, we're gonna be kicking ourselves in the butt. I'm gonna spice things up a bit more for this Christmas season. If you make at least three program payments of $200 each before December 1st, 2016, I'll send you a personally autographed and numbered Scott Farkas action figure, right? They're beautiful. With an autographed print. And I have a number of different shots. They will be, also be autographed. Um, you'll receive it in time for Christmas. And <laughs> Chris posted, good luck in finding these online because they go for 300 bucks a pop. For you, I'll always be your Huckleberry. But the whole point is this. If we get this done, if we have product that 
can go viral, that's funny, that's impactful, that's interesting, that's smart, that's savvy. And we can ride this Farkas wave. I mean, I think it's as ridiculous as you do, but it is a cultural phenomenon. If we can do that, we'd be idiots not to. Uh, we have a great window of opportunity. Daily fantasy is biting the dust. We have the best product and the best idea that's actually right for the country, right for its citizens, right for sports. We've got the Farkas wave. We need to ride this. You know us. We're going to do our best every single chance we can. We need your help. We need to bang this out. We need to get it done. We need to make ASM a household name. Thank you so much for your time. Enjoy the rest of the email below. I look forward to seeing you all again at the football event. I believe that's right on the Super Bowl. Have a great time. Talk to you later.